this pillow is pretty comfortable. I highly recommend pillows for your head when you're out of bed. Yeah? Yep. It's okay. better than a rock. Take it into consideration. I'll remember that. You're welcome. <laughs> that tidbit of information. What if I do this? Is this, is this better? Is everyone louder now? Hello. Hello. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Forever. You um, and me. Yeah. I don't even know if the stream's going or not. Oh, there it is. I wanna lick, 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 lick. Oh, that's a bad song, sir. Did someone just leave the call? That went weird. Yeah, no. Hello? Oh. Hello? Hello? Huh? Okay, that's much better. Everyone, Cry say something. I think Cry's the one that left. Yeah, no. Oh, yeah, Cry left. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. He's still here on for me. Oh, never mind. Yep. Are those really helicopter crashes? That is. That, that big explosion back there? I see two of them. Yep. Yep. Those are helicopter crashes. Yeah, they are very close to each other, you're right. But let's go check them out. Which direction are you coming? Uh, you don't see my flare? Flare. Oh, I'm on the road still. Oh. oh. Alright, uh, what's the next question, Settle? Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, what is your most expensive purchase? Oh. Graphics card. That's a good one. Bought a house once. That was pretty expensive. <laughs> that would be my first computer. Pre-built. You see it now? See it. Okay. Hello. Is is anyone else here even alive? No. Uh, They're I very died. quiet. I died, but I came back. I. Who wants to know oh. what your most expensive purchase was? Ever. Most expensive purchase? Yeah. Oh. $1,800 bed for my mom. Yeah? Yeah, I actually just bought that today, even, so that's kind of a funny thing when you ask that. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Her bed was too firm, so I figured, hey. Yeah. Here. Hey, look at this person here. I am a person. Hey, person. Yeah, person. Hi. How you doing? Cool. Okay, apparently the sound is now fixed, by the way, guys. Apparently. Sweet. Good. That's awesome. Hey, right, you ready to head out? I'm gonna go pick up your player. And everyone Don't else do is that. Oh, okay. What's your next question, Settle? Why is no one right. is Keep the flashlight? Was the most amount of money you had at once? A thousand dollars. Uh, thirteen hundred. In like in in my hands or hands, hands in... or bank account, you could choose. Thirteen, fourteen thousand. Uh, twenty-five thousand dollars. Well, are you a little miss? Rich. <laughs> so I haven't got it now. I wish I did. <laughs> Good job, Minx. You made all of us feel silly. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh... But, but I am like, I think I'm older than everyone else. Yeah, probably. Yeah, I think I am. Yeah. yeah. Not that That's much a good reason. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> grandmother. I am um, 42, everyone. Jesus Christ. No. Oh. You're a gulf. That's a pretty young grandmother, to be honest. T to be fair. <laughs> babies like, having wait, babies. The reason <laughs> I've had more money than you guys is because the British currency is worth loads more than the dollar. That's why. <laughs> America. Yeah. Heck you're yeah. Not, you're not happy just just insulting everyone in the chat. You have to insult <laughs> the, the whole country as well. Right. Yeah. 
Hey, man, America is sucks, bro. I, uh, I agree with you. <laughs> I never said America sucks. Oh, it was <laughs> your booze, Zumba. <laughs> you sound pretty tired as well, Mr. Battlestar. No, I'm not. You sure? Yes. yes. <laughs> I'm sure. Terrorism. Sometimes. <laughs> what did you just say, Craig? Terrorism? Yeah, shh. Hey, don't make me get my help. Uh, I'm just gonna lay down here. I'm just gonna be very quiet. Everyone keep down, okay? Try and get some sleep. I think that's everyone's questions. Good job. Good job. Thank you very much, Mr. Kaiba. I hope you have a good time running your multinational corporation. It's working fine, I suppose. Hey. But considering I have this much time, it should be fine. Did did you invent those black Yu-Gi-Oh cards? What? That's racist. <laughs> I'm asking a legitimate question. Jeez. Oh, yeah. my back. I invented the dual disc and the holograms that you see. Oh yeah, that was that Toriyaki me person. I forget his name. He also invented money. <laughs> oh, if you can't ask him why he invented the black ones, because I don't understand those. Oh, yeah. That's racist again. <laughs> yep. <laughs> that one, that time it was. Uh, so, all this call is just racism. Oh, have a good one, Zero. Bye. Bye, Zero. Bye, Zero. Bye, Zero. What a sweetie pie. Oh. Uh, you should probably find a wonderful female reporter to touch on topics that are of close romantic relations to his heart. Uh huh. <laughs> I have no idea what you just said. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah. Hi Red. Hi Scott. Hi Cry. Hi Russ. Hi Snake. Hi Ming Mix. Hi Def. Hello. I didn't Hi. say my hair yet. How's it hey, going? Uh, it's going good, thank you. That's pretty good. Oh. Yeah. Hey Ballstar. Hi. Do you like Cthulhu's? Cthulhu's? Cthulhu's. Cthulhu's? What is that? Cthulhu. What is that? Explain Cthulhu somebody. Hello, can you hear me? Hi! Hi there. Hi. Can you explain Cthulhu to Battlestar? Thank you. <laughs> uh, you went from like, being able to be heard to not. What are you doing? Can you hear me doing? now? Yes. Excellent. Can Sorry, you explain my, my... Cthulhu to Battlestar? Uh, Cthulhu is a deity of madness created by H.P. Lovecraft that is currently dead in the city of Rayleigh, which I believe is like somewhere under the oceans. To look upon him, you are struck by madness. And I think he can only be uh, revived or resurrected when the stars are right. And... At, there's something in there about when even death can die or something like that. That was pretty. Ah. It's been a while. Sorry, it's been a while since I've read the exact um, mythos. I think you get a better, better explanation than anyone else in this call would have been able to do. And yeah, I still don't fully understand what it is. It's okay, he's a god of madness. You're not supposed to understand everything. <laughs> Yay, my not knowing was justified. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so what's your question, Rioni? Well, hi. I I actually sent like three to you that I would like to ask. If that's okay with you guys? Yes, go ahead. Okay. Well, my first one was if you had to live in any post-apocalyptic world, what would it be and why? Uh, like, I, like in the world-ending scenario, if you had to live. In basically a destroyed world, which which 
one would you go for? If the enemies were very fragile or edible, because it would be easy to defeat them. <laughs> like crab people? You can make crabs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'd say crabs are delicious. It's a good choice. <laughs> uh, man, I... Any I personally, do I have to live through it? No, you can, that's your decision if you're in the post-apocalyptic world. Can I be there for the apocalyptic portion of it? Like when shit you goes have to, down? For, for it to be post-apocalyptic, you have to live past <clears throat> the apocalypse, but you can be there when shit goes down as long as you survive it. Okay, all right, cool. So I want to live through, like, the apocalypse, right? But it's the kind that has, like, it's what the Bible's like, oh, it's going to be flaming horsemen in the skies and all these people, sinners, or some other bullshit. Anyway, it sounds pretty cool. So I want to live through that. And then I want to, like, die. Cause just fuck surviving that shit, right? <laughs> yeah, cause then all my that? friends would probably be dead. Cause my friends don't know what the fuck to do to live. So it's just like, man, nah, fuck it. So yeah, I want to <laughs> do that one. All the flaming horsemen and shit. That'd be cool. Nice. Man. Yeah. Wait. Did Wait. I... No. <laughs> Everything I just said. Fuck that. I want to live in Fragile Dreams post-apocalyptic because there's like fucking ghost chicks and they can hang out with you and stuff. And random I wanna... cats. Yeah, I want that one because apparently there's a fuck ton of free food lying around all the place too, so. And, and sorts. Every night. Yes. I want that one. That sounds a pretty good deal. I want ghost chick friends. Damn it. <laughs> Has anybody else uh, had a post-apocalyptic world they've entertained living in? I like to live in, like, Waterworld, like the movie. Everyone hates the movie, but I thought it was pretty cool. I like, <laughs> to, like, grow, I like to, like, grow fins and shit and live under the sea and play with Sebastian the crab and just have a really good time. <laughs> <laughs> have fun with the sunburn, things. shit. Yeah, sunburn would suck, though. The whole time, he'll be like fucking Sebastian the Crab. <laughs> <laughs> maybe, maybe there's your crab people. So you just live on Waterworld too, and you're just eating other people. You just don't know, because they're sunburned all the hell. You yeah, the whole stuff. time, you just be laying there with this wicked sunburn, you have no idea how to get rid of it. You're just like, oh my god. You would be able to enjoy yourself. That would be terrible. Thanks, you're, you're drunk. <laughs> what? God damn it, Meg. Stop drinking like that. It's yeah, I just, just, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's sunny, my, sunny, my sick bottle. It'll be fine. It's, it's fine. Uh, it's fine. It'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, my uh, second question is pretty much to all of you. Uh, um, what are your dream careers and why? Uh, uh, definition, you go first. <laughs> uh, making the musics and the voice actings. And why? <laughs> because that's what I like to do. How dare you like to do things. I know. You asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, dream career. Oh, dude, I know what I want to be. I want to be. I want to be. Uh, the very you know best. They, no, no, no. You know how they got fluffers? I want to be that for the girls. <laughs> <laughs> I think. <laughs> <laughs> What's fluffers? <laughs> oh, 
Holy shit. Yeah. <laughs> Should we excuse him? That's oh. not required. <laughs> God sake. Just do it when the stream's over. <laughs> I have to say that it's probably the most honest answer I have ever received to that question. That, that was an <laughs> great answer. I'm, I'm really impressed. <laughs> <laughs> Oh gosh, that was great. That was magnificent. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I can't laugh and cry, thank you. <laughs> or someone could just pee on me. Uh, <laughs> right, right, right. Uh, we, uh, we can draw you a picture. Also. Okay. <laughs> oh lord. Uh, <sighs> Let's have a <laughs> everyone in chat's like career. everyone in chat's like floppers question mark. <laughs> Good. Uh, if I picked a dream career, I would. I would like to. To be fair, like anything where I'm like self-employed and stuff, and like doing something I enjoy, I'd like to do voice acting or um, anything where I don't have to have some asshole boss yelling at me all the time telling me to do stuff because like I lost my last job because I called my boss a very rude word that I can't say on this stream and um yeah you killed <laughs> your boss? I, I, I killed my no I didn't kill him oh. I just was just very rude to him oh. I, said, I said the c word and um oh, you called him a cock <laughs> <laughs> but yeah anything where I, I don't have to like answer to anyone else is a good thing <laughs> I mean, if you look at if you look at stream chat, are moment, you dying, Russ? He's dying a lot. He died of yeah. starvation. Yeah, I'm dying. No, not starvation. Mm, yeah, I got shot in the face. Mm. Lost all my stuff. The there you go. By the way, uh, that will start in chat. There's the uh, definition. Huh. Uh, okay. I'm turning off my light. This is gonna be such a good time with you guys. And does, does anybody else have a dream career that does not include a fluffer? Ah, <laughs> uh, I understand. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, explain it to us, Buster. I want to know your if your understanding of fluffer. You know, you know, film stars. <laughs> 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 yeah, like Robert Downey Jr. and stuff? Yeah, like those. I have to say, if Robert Downey Jr., I wouldn't put it past Robert Downey Jr. to be in that kind of film, gotta say. Yeah. Sherlock Holmes, the porno. <laughs> I'm sorry, Robert, Robert Downey, Robert Downey Jr. Downey Jr. <laughs> He's gonna be in Sherlock Bones. And now a <laughs> <friend Holmes>. new... <laughs> You just created a crossover cry. Congratulations. I'm okay with it. To be fair, like, uh, Iron Man could just be the name of a porno. <laughs> <laughs> and yet they fuck it up and just like, I am dick. <laughs> I, was, I was considering saying that, but I was like, nah, I'm a guest. I'll let them make the dirty jokes. Uh, that's I'm so not saying Robert Downey Jr. film so I can make more puns on every film title he's ever done. <laughs> so, uh, Nate, do you have a dream career? Novelist. That's a good answer. Hmm. Are you yeah, going to write nice porn shit. too? Yes. Alright. Starring Robert Downey Jr. <laughs> <laughs> he was in Kiss Kiss Bang Bang. Exactly. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Fifty Shades of Snake. Starring Robert Downey Jr. <laughs> <laughs> in the script, he will be, rather in the, um, the draft, he will be listed as made one. <laughs> that would be the best casting ever. Oh. I'm starting a Kickstarter for this. I was... This whole time I was confusing Robert Downey Jr. with uh, John C. Riley. <laughs> How the fuck do you make these mistakes, Melissa? I really don't get it. 
know who John C. Riley is. I'm gonna look this up. It's that he's really ugly. Yeah. He's Dr. Steve Brule. Yeah, he's Dr. Steve Brule. I don't know who that is. Step brothers. They want the uh, one of the brothers. Oh I god, no. But that, that oh, makes like... sense. I know who he is now. Yeah, I've, I've unfortunately seen him in films before. Oh. I like Dr. Steve. I mean, John C. Riley. <laughs> Me too. He's pretty cool. I liked how Dagon Knights. That one was good. But that's definitely how not a Robert Downey Jr. I know. <laughs> he wasn't even in Iron Man. Poor <laughs> <laughs> Sherlock Holmes. <laughs> Come on. Uh, okay. Hello. I'll uh, B Star. Do you have you answered uh, what your dream uh, career would be? Uh, maybe uh, entertainer. What? Hello, well. Okay. Uh, well, my, uh... Sorry, go ahead. Oh, no, go ahead. You'll see something funny, because I was about to move to my next question. You know, like, friggin... I from the spot, Jesus. You know that, you know, Freddie Wong, uh, he, he makes those kind of videos, entertains yeah. us. He wants to be the song that plays in every ice cream truck ever. <laughs> guys, guys, I just need to point out that I just went to the uh, I went to the Wikipedia page for Fluffer, and it says, YouTuber Chaotic Monkey has been officially oh, certified by the great no. Fluffer on Earth. <laughs> no! Congratulations, Kai. In the measure of about three minutes, you have officially obtained your dream career. Uh -huh. Wait, that's a good thing. Yay! <laughs> hey, oh. uh, it's a proof. You may as well screen cap it, Kai. <laughs> Take your moment of fame. I don't want to get up to do it. <laughs> <laughs> put it on Tumblr. And I'll fucking put it in my favorites. Yes. <laughs> Yeah. Break out that trophy again. What trophy? <laughs> <laughs> One second. That, that's basically your dream. You want to earn that trophy. Everybody, cry wins. Oh. <laughs> Fatality. There you go. It's perfect. The okay, best, so, the best uh, fluffer I'm... ever. Thank you. Okay, so my third question's a, a bit more serious. Have you, or are you planning on sponsoring, uh, doing like a charity-like event? Yeah. What? That's I'm doing that next week. Where have you been? I'm sorry, I've been at college studying for the last week solid. Nerd. She told you. Uh, I, am an, I am a nerd. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. What am I doing here I'm being a nerd? <laughs> What do you mean? Yeah. yeah, the first question you asked me was was about Cthulhu. I think pretty much by answering that, I have confirmed my status as a nerd. I thought maybe you said a thing for him. I don't know. He does have tentacles. I, uh, <laughs> yeah, I, like <laughs> I, could, I could make a horribly racist joke about being Japanese here, but I won't. Oh, uh, yeah. Battlestar might have some competition for his heart with you and he... And, and... <laughs> Up what? There. What's going on? I have competition. Why? No, you don't. Telling you to watch out for. <laughs> oh, you need to ask competition because why? Because she's Japanese. No. <laughs> no. Oh. No. Oh, she's not. Saying I couldn't. I couldn't. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not Japanese. What kind of friend are you? Don't know the nationality <laughs> of my girlfriend. I don't know. It's those Asian. She's okay? Korean, you dummy. Thank you, Russ. Bye. <laughs> 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 God, this Ends out on a... Oh god. <laughs> so, have you announced the charity yet? What? <laughs> <laughs> uh, for for the charity event you're doing, have you announced the charity yet? Cuz if so, oh. I have just I the date. Oh, I I'm making an official video for it, but um yeah, I'm doing it for All Children's Hospital. And I'm doing a 24-hour stream of Nino Kuni. Uh, yeah. And hopefully I won't be sick as fuck during oh, it. Oh, that's a new sound. Very nice. Oh, you discovered a new sound. Good job. That sounds pretty cool. 
So if it goes still well, not rolling your R's. <laughs> Here, let me try again. B I. <laughs> oh my God, battles are really bad. Really? Yeah, I don't even know what that means either. Uh, it's okay. So, uh, if it goes well, are you going to be doing another fundraiser at some point in the future, or is it going to be like you think you're only going to do this once? Um. That really just depends on how old, if, what happens, you know? That's more of like, a, hey, let's see if I hate myself after this or not. I don't think I'll hate myself after it, but I just gotta make sure first before I sign on. You'll, you'll probably hate living for a few hours afterwards, but yeah. after you you'll be like, oh, okay, I did a pretty good thing. Yeah, man, that's pretty good there. I, yeah, but why do you, why do you ask? Oh, because um, it's actually for a kind of self-serving reason. I um, I run a charity, and I'm trying to get, like, awareness out there. So I was asking, so I was pretty much going to ask how I would go about possibly contacting you for trying to raise awareness. Ah, uh, what awareness is this? Um... Can, can I just like plug it here? Because it's hard to go into detail without like. Battlestar, can she plug it? Plug it in the wall socket. Plug it in. Plug it in. Yeah. <laughs> sure. Go ahead. Whatever that means. Uh, well, the uh, the charity's called Operation Wolfhound, and we train uh, service dogs for veterans with post traumatic stress disorder and uh, traumatic brain injury at no cost to the veteran. It's completely like volunteer run and and stuff like that so oh that's nice and we're, thank you we we've placed over 60 dogs in the last two years and it's gotten to the point where we have to start accepting like donations and we need more volunteers because it's getting really big you know to the point where like me and my family can't handle it by ourselves anymore so that's that's basically what i was gonna try and talk to you about because we need peeps That'll start. I mean, the snake. That's perfect for your dad. That's a joke. <laughs> well, even if it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> 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 well, Thank even you. if it's not or whatever. <laughs> well, if any of you know anybody who needs help. You know, just point them our way. We're on Facebook and everything. Uh, uh, yeah, so you guys have my Skype, so if you want to arrange something in the future or whatever, you know how to get a hold of me, pretty much. I just want to thank you for letting me take the time to tell you what I'm about and stuff like that. No problem, miss. I can't see names because I have my head in my pillow. But uh, my I'm... name's Miller. I'm gonna say your name is Budweiser, so thank you, Budweiser. <laughs> well, uh, yeah, I actually got on here like two two months ago, I think maybe. Wow, Star, how dare you slip up like this? Oh, I'm okay. sorry. I was very polite. He has a soft spot for people who are polite. Oh, I've... yeah. And Japanese people. <laughs> <The> Japanese. <laughs> You mean Korean people? For people of oh. not his ethnicity. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's what it's okay. called. I thought it was like nationality or something. Goddamn, What? Come you learn every. You learn at least one thing you learn every stream night. Yeah, I know. I'm pretty glad to be a part of it. <laughs> it's like, All right, well, it's I'm like sure my own personal have, school. Uh, I'm sure you guys have like plenty of other callers. Thank you for you know letting me tell you guys about the organization. And if if you are inclined at any time in the future to contact me about it, about any you know anything about it, feel free. We're always open to communication. Hey, thank you for the question. Thank you for the information on Cthulhu. Cool. <laughs> You're welcome. That's the real takeaway from all this. <laughs> <laughs> I told you about a god of madness when I came in, and then I tell you that I'm part of an organization that helps deal with madness. So, it's ironic that I know so much. So I need much. to think deeper on yeah. 
Okay, let's 